write the balanced equation for NaNO3 decomposing into NaNO2 plus O2. Let's count the atoms up. We have one sodium, one nitrogen, and three oxygens. On the product side, we have one sodium, one nitrogen, and two oxygens, plus we have these two oxygens here with the O2, so we have four. Everything's balanced right now except the oxygens. Probably the best approach is to try to get this to be an even number, and we can do that by multiplying the whole NaNO3, the sodium nitrate, by two. So we have one times two, that gives us two sodiums, one nitrogen times two, that'll give us two nitrogens, and the three oxygens times two, that'll give us six oxygens. So now we have an even number. Let's fix the sodiums, that should fix the nitrogens, and it might even fix the oxygens. We can do that by putting a two as our coefficient in front of the sodium nitrite. We have one times two, that gives us two sodiums, those are balanced. One times two for the nitrogen, that'll give us two of those. Let's update the oxygens. We have the two times the two, that's four, plus we have the two here, and that gives us six. And we're done, this equation is balanced. The key here, people sometimes have problems because they don't count up all of the oxygens. That makes it really difficult. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for the decomposition of sodium nitrate. Thanks for watching.